I've received a lot of comments on my subreddit posts asking me how I pause the timer and basically use all the cheats that I have when I'm practicing and finding these smokes. What I have to do, or pretty much the only thing I have to do, is load up whatever map I want. Let's just play on split. And all I have to do is turn this little thing right here, cheat, to on, which it already is right here. That's it. I've been accused of hacking, I've been accused of cheating, and now we're actually going to go into the map and see what we've actually done. Let's actually change it to Haven. Once you actually get into the game, you'll see that in the settings menu, there's a new tab that says cheats. Here you can see a bunch of them that are really just exactly what they sound like. Pause match timer does exactly that. If I turn it off, it starts ticking down. If I turn it back on, it stops. There's infinite abilities, infinite ammo, infinite magazines, infinite creds, and ignore shopping restrictions. Once again, they're basically exactly what they sound like. There's invulnerability, which, you know, is pretty much god mode. Auto respawn, in which you can still take damage and die, but you'll spawn right where you are again. Now, end game phase, restart game, and swap team are something of a little bit confusing. End game phase ends the phase that you're on at that moment. So right now, I'm in the warm up or buy phase. If I press it, I will then be in the game phase. I can then go ahead and plant. I can pretty much do whatever I want and there will be no restrictions with walls. If I press it one more time, I will lose and I will be in the sort of final seven seconds of the game. If I press it one more time, I will no loop back doubts. into the warm up. Ready. Restart game is a little bit similar to that, except it well, restarts ready. completely no the game, changing the score to 0-0. Zero, zero. Now swap team is also pretty interesting because it doesn't actually change your spawn or where you are. You don't magically spawn over on the other side. If I press it, the bomb changes to sort of a red color, and then, you know, I can't actually pick it up and go plant it, but I can defuse it. That is how some people actually go ahead and plant the bomb and then defuse it themselves. 